Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing a quick unboxing of the T16 wireless touchpad. I actually bought this to replace the Re touchpad. Um, I'm not happy with this keyboard because not soon after, maybe a month or two after I bought this, the LED that uh, lights the keys started flickering and sometimes it would stay on, sometimes it would go off. I contacted the company through Amazon, I contacted the company directly to get a replacement or to at least get some support or you know some ideas. They never responded back, so I'm never gonna buy our RII um, or re keyboard for that matter. Um, that may have been just a fluke. It happened uh, shortly after the uh, return period, so I'm gonna tr give this T16 a try. I'm gonna unbox it really quick. This is not an official. Um, this is not an official review. As you know, if you're new to my channel, my reviews. Uh, are usually done six months into owning the product because you can just like ha what happened with this keyboard you give it a review and a couple of weeks or a month later down the line it dies so that's the brand Anna wish any wish any wish Anyway, so it comes with a micro USB. You would think it would be USB-C, but for the price, not bad. Uh, this is the keyboard itself. And this is not Bluetooth, this is Wi-Fi. It should have a dongle in here. Yep, there it is. And I love that you can replace the battery. Let's check out the Re. Unlike the Re, i8 Plus, you probably have to take it apart to remove the battery. But the fact that this is readily available, and it looks like there's a model that you can probably have double A batteries. That's why it has, it has these slots here. Has this left and right button, which is probably used for video gaming. Um, and the light is kind of pretty bright. If you hold down FN and the arrow up, when it's on, the on off button is right here. So it's off now, now it should be on. So if you hold the, the FN button, you see that blinking. And I think if you push it up, see little, the little light bulb icon there? It will light up the keyboard. So it only has one setting. It doesn't go dim to dimmest to brightest. But hey, it works. And then you have the little touchpad. I'm going to give this a few weeks, maybe months of testing and beating on it and then I'll come back and provide a good review a real-life review so thanks for watching this quick unboxing of the AnyWish T16 wireless touchpad mini keyboard all right guys thanks for watching